Okay, so we're gonna admit her, administer a uh, static test to the drain system of this home. To do that, we're gonna place a balloon inside the drain line where it exits the home, usually at the main front clean house. Uh, we're gonna blow this balloon up to where it will prevent any water from exiting the drain system. Once we do that, we'll fill everything up with water and see if it all holds. Now, one of the misconceptions about this is that a lot of people believe that this can damage the pipe, but the pipe is made to be able to withstand this test. This test was designed specifically for drain pipes. Um, now, we're gonna put 35 pounds of pressure inside this balloon so if the structural integrity of the pipe has already been compromised, then the inflation of the balloon could damage an already damaged pipe. But under normal circumstances, the test would never damage a pipe. All pipes are made to withstand this test. Um, once we fill it up with water, one of the things we wanna be careful of, the finished floor of the house is right about here. These cleanouts are too tall, so we want to make sure we don't fill them up too high or we could get a lot of water come out inside the house. So we'll, we'll fill this up to a little bit lower than that brick ledge so we don't have to worry about any wax seals being bad on the toilets. Once we have the whole system filled up, we'll give it about 15 minutes to see if it holds. If it holds, everything's good. If, uh, if the water level starts to drop, that means the water's leaking out of a pipe somewhere under the house, in which case we would have to do some more advanced diagnostics to locate those leaks and see how many of them there might be. Turn it off.